Today we're jumping into the most outrageous Karen and Kevin clips this week. You're gonna wanna hold on to your hats because these people are about to blow you away. Let's get into it. Here's a disabled person who thinks he's untouchable, going around and seeing people and picking fights. You're a f and you know what? I suck the Alright? I suck the Pressing charges! Pressing charges! Pressing charges! Pressing charges! Hey! You are the disabled trans people person! You stupid man! Come and get him! Come and get him! Come and get him! Here's a paranoid woman who harasses innocent workers, claiming the water they gave her is poisoned and asking them to drink it to prove it's not. Now drink it. Drink it. It's just water, right? It is. Drink it then. Because it's poison. It's poison. Now Drink this. It's just water, right? Yeah. Why do I need to drink it? To prove it's not poisoned. You asked for water. Drink it. But you didn't ask me to video me either. Why did you drink it? It's your water. Why would that we poison is, you? That's a good reason. That's a good. Why wouldn't you drink it? If it's just water. Why would I drink it? So that's all the way. Give it to me. Just drink it. Cause it's poison, and you know it. Have a great day. Have a good day, ma'am. Wait, I'm dying. Thank you. I'm a grandmother and a mother, and you guys are killing me, and you don't care. I was killing you. You're poisoning me. This water's water? poison. Drink it. Why did you prove it? Drink it. Drink it. You won't because it's poison, and you know it. Well, let me get my phone out to record. You will not drink it, okay? Let's do that. And then you can leave after that. With no water. Don't cut your phone off. Don't cut it off. Please don't cut the phone off. Leave the phone on to her. This woman right here is saying well, the family just gave her some water that's poison. She wants me to drink her water for her to prove that it's not poison. Because she's a mother and a grandmother. And, she, and we're poisoning her. We're killing her. And we are not. And she didn't ask me to film me, but she's filming me. Your name is? Exactly. You know what my name is. I don't even know you, ma'am. You lie. I've never seen you a day in okay. my life. Okay. Okay. Girl, this is crazy. Water. Now what would you like? Have a great day. Yeah. You didn't drink it. She's out of the You did it. You recorded me leaving? Have a great murderous life. Here's a woman who stumbled into a clothing store, tried to walk off with some merchandise, and got caught and called out by the staff. She of course makes a big show of the affair, but the way these employees handle the situation is hilarious. I'm not taking no money. I don't give a f about taking shit off. You crazy as hell. I don't give a shit. I'm not taking shit off. You crazy as hell. I don't give a shit. I'm not taking shit off. You crazy as hell. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I can't hold you. But I'm so petty. Get the f off of me. Y'all just want to be with the wrong one. Y'all so thirsty. Boy, you're talking me out. Oh, I, don't got, I don't got nothing to do with this. Shit. I'm making sure I'm protected. I ain't touch you. But I recorded it. They can pay me $5,000 right now. And I give them the footage. <laughs> We trying to go though, man. Pay for it. He locked my Sir, they already owe me money. I don't know nothing about none of that. You know I'm just trying to go, man. Thing. Well, That's the police just got coming. I don't give a f I don't give a f man. They rolled by. How the f they missed the store? Oh my god! Oh my god! Come on! Amy, 
Joe, come inside. It's dangerous. Watch this clip of a planned grab and run in China that completely caught this poor owner by surprise. Here's an Australian guy in an intense road rage moment, and to top it off, he's armed with a boomerang. The woman behind the camera and her husband are in an ongoing feud with their downstairs neighbors in this Dallas apartment complex. The neighbors say their child is stomping around and making noise as early as 4 a.m. They even threaten to call Child Protective Services because of the noise. That's not really how CPS works, but anyway, let's take a look. You're so... No, I'm not. But do what you're talking. Do it. Say everything that you were saying. Both of you. Fine. I said we have called the police okay. on you multiple times. And why is that? For your inconsideration. But who's and inconsideration? Your child run around until four o'clock in the morning. I can call CPS on you if I wanted to, but I'm not going to. My daughter doesn't have no bruises, no nothing for you to say that. She fell. Um, why are I you calling, why are you gonna call CPS on me? Neglect. <laughs> ne letting child, your, child neglect? Letting your daughter stay I can up show you 4 o'clock in the morning. Oh honey, she has a schedule. She sleeps by 10. Okay. And if you when hear me at 4 Who's stomping? All, all night. Who's stomping? Nobody stomps at 4 in the morning. Yes, thank you. That, that is already you guys. I hear me, you guys banging, him, banging at my face. ceiling, at no, my no, ceiling. You get y'all to That's stop. Right, yes. Whenever it's that late in the Then morning. honestly, that's your problem because we sleep by 10. She's asleep by 10. If you want to sleep in my house, I'm telling you. Really? I'm telling you because we put her to sleep me? at 10. Because last I checked, if you, you want, if you want, Nicole if you want. Nicole literally came to the apartment today and it sounded Nicole. like y'all were dragging a body across the floor. Her <laughs> words, not mine. Okay, and she came up this morning, the same thing. She said that, that she heard everything and she said, I hear loud stomping mm -hmm. and that is it. And that's why not, are you guys taking, okay, because the issue is stopped. my daughter. The issue is my daughter because she plays daughter every day. My daughter does not morning. stay up for okay. the morning. Okay, then who is doing the stomping? I don't know, but I'm telling you that nobody stays up before in the morning because everyone is asleep by 10 or 11. She's asleep by 10 or 11. I don't let her stay up by four in the morning or whatever you really, are saying. Because we have and multiple videos recording y'all at like three or okay, four. Okay, then you said against me. Get me we out will. of here if you want. We are. We're in the process of it. Okay. Babe. Your pride and your ego are so it's not up pride here. and ego. Oh babe. no, it is. It's honey. really not. It's really so not. you're bothered by it's having a regular full -time job and knowing that I have to get up at six o'clock in the morning okay. every day. It's normal. And this is the apartment living. Four. This is apartment living. Again, She's a toddler. No. This has never ha I've lived okay, in that's, okay, that's it's not you, apartment okay, living. That's you, it may it be your may... apartment living from the ghetto, but from this, the ghetto? Yeah. This isn't oh, this that's is the ghetto? only apartment complex. This is ghetto? I never said this is ghetto, babe. I said maybe the other apartments you've lived in. Oh no, this is my first time renting, honey. That makes sense. Okay, that makes sense. Ex you just admitted it. That makes sense. So then have control over. Um, no, because I am a first time mom. This is not my daughter. I am a first time mom. She is my first, and I am not gonna be there controlling her and telling her, oh, don't do this, don't do that, because the downstairs neighbors don't want you to make noise. Oh my, I it's need a, I need a set of over your kid. Um, no, she what is, is she living gonna grow up to be better than you. That's for sure. Clearly not. not. You. Clearly no, because not, she's because gonna because be I'm very not understandable. Over here stomping, disturbing my downstairs neighbors. Oh my. We've already talked to both of them downstairs, oh and they said they don't hear us. 
Our that's roommate right. is and like 320 pounds. Not to like, mention. He walk lightly. Yeah, and not to mention, okay. y'all have had multiple complaints from y'all's neighbors as well. Okay. So it's not just us. Okay, what do you want me to do? I have a daughter. I'm not gonna move for you to feel happy because my daughter's happy up there. That's fine. That's all that matters to me. I'm not gonna be here trying to make then somebody else happy. Unfortunately, you're gonna have to get evicted. Um, well, Nicole if, is in the process of it. Event, she is evicted. Do you know what that means? Oh no, I know what that means. Good. But if if then that I were can't true, wait to see your moving boxes. Okay, then okay. I'll show her the video. I'll show her the video that you good. everything that you're saying. Good, because she knows it's all true. Okay, and that is that true? Yeah, we've had many conversations with her. Oh, uh, the okay. courtesy officers, the didn't PD. Like, oh, okay. Look, if yeah, you guys moved to the first floor, this would be a non-issue. I know that it wouldn't would be, be an issue. Good. What's, 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 what's the problem is that if they really wanted us to move, if you guys really wanted us to move, you tell them to give us the same payment that we are paying. That's exactly. what we're Literally trying we've been to do. Trying to get um, but she's thing. not. But she's so not. funny because y'all are the problem. How so are we the problem? Y'all are the ones stomping. Y'all are the ones destroying. We are not neighbors. stomping. It's my daughter they playing with her. Literally just said when Nicole. It's, it's not her. Like right now, okay. It, it's probably her if I had to take a then, guess. But okay, listen, you just admitted listen, it, but control listen. her. You need Later to control her. Night, whenever, we, whenever we are. I'm um, just pointing at you. Whenever I'm sorry if you get offended, but I'm just pointing at you because listen, it is you. Whenever we are trying to sleep in. I'm Late sorry, and I have been controlled here. We no, haven't been here for not, five I understand. days, and I'm it's sorry about that. I'm sorry, and I I respect you, but the way she's acting, come on now, you have to admit it. She's frustrated. Just exactly, like I am. I'm frustrated too. I have a family. I have a daughter. How do you think that makes me feel? She plays in the kitchen. She takes out all my drinks. I have closed them. She finds a way to open it. Then I. Maybe lock them. I, that's what I just said. I have a baby lunch, but she opens them. She is a very smart baby. I don't zip know what. Tie. Just cut, zip tie. Cut, zip tie. If y'all really want to try and make this work, make it better, y'all would be coming up with any idea y'all can to try and make it better. Well, now that's a whole different story than what you told me earlier. What? It's a whole different story. I've had DoorDash one other time. And but, what, but, but when I asked you, had you DoorDash before, you told me I said, no. I, I did not say that. You did. No, I did not. You yes, said you, you said, has any of your teachers let you DoorDash before? And I said, no, a sub let me do it. And that's what happened today, too. I have the same sub, or I have a different sub in the same class, and I ordered DoorDash, and you ate my food. So you made us no, I'm moving forward, yes, but that doesn't give him the right to eat my food. That's, 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 the issue is done. We move forward with you differently, and we'll get your food, so it's done. It's, 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 it's not even I should have had to wait, and I'm going to miss some of my class waiting for this. Waiting for my food to get here, and I haven't eaten all day. The issue's not even broken. I just want to know why he ate my food. <laughs> that's what I'm not going to do. Yeah, you ate my food. That's what you did do. Go ahead and leave. You ate my food. I want my money back. I'm not paying for you to eat. First of all, I didn't eat it. So you can what do you, why is my food eaten? Why did my milkshake have a drink taken out of it? Why does this burger have a bite in it and just put back in the bag? And why is it missing a whole burger? Step out. Go calm down and then you can come back. I'm not waiting. I don't have that much lunch period because I wasted it waiting for you. Go step out. Go. I'm not losing my food or my money or my time because of you. Lock. He took my food. There's a bite taken out of it and it's missing a whole burger. There was a sip taken out of the shake. This is just normal cheeseburger. Look at this. These Karens of Tulsa came out to complain about a resolution declaring the city as welcoming and compassionate to all people, something Karens tend not to be. I can see why they're offended. Let's remember that, um, that we are talking about people. How do people die from being not feeling safe? And suicide. So do I feel safe in your Tulsa? And how rude. That's Their your time. Agenda. Thank you. May I say that you're very rude in no. looking at me like that. No, you may not. Please sit down. Solution needs to be struck. It's very hypocritical. But if I'm laughed at or cheered at, I'll stop and expect my time to pick back up when they're done. 
you know, it's my opinion that um, we don't even need this. I mean, the fact that we even have to have this is disturbing to me at such a guttural level. It's such a dichotomy and paradoxical to me because we should be welcoming and loving and be kind and respectful to everyone. Word inclusive. This word is inflammatory and it's dangerous to welcome just anything. We are inclusive already. Uh, to me, the pushback on this is more about people feeling uncomfortable about making space for other people who are different than them, but people who are different are also real. And I never thought I would imagine that in the year 2023 in Tulsa, in our city, we were going to be talking about Molotov cocktails. A small business in Brookside firebombed. Yes, hate crimes are happening in our city. Under every single one of these listed classes, I am represented and all of you are represented. That includes your right to have your own personal worldviews, desires, ways of worship. It does not include the right to dehumanize others. It is not a redundancy because my life is not a redundancy. This racist Karen totally freaks out when she sees a black guy in the neighborhood. So she starts following him, filming and asking questions about where he lives and stuff like that. Y'all see this, yo? Yo, this lady right here been following me for the last block and a half for what I don't know. Lady, why you keep following me, yo? You see this? What, what call me for what? Why is you following me? Damn it. All I was doing was jogging around the neighborhood. All I was doing was jogging. You started following me for what? Weirdo? What? Do you live in here? Do I live here? Yeah, yeah I live here. Why are you asking me that question? Where do you live? Who are you? Is you the police, the security? What you around here, yo? No. Niggas don't know your dumb ass, man. Yo, get from around me, yo. Stop following me. What is you following me for? Is it because I'm black? This that racist shit, yo. You voted for Trump, didn't you, yo? No, no, no. Listen, don't bring the racist stuff up. I've just never seen anybody like you around here before. What you mean, like me? You know, like your kind. Did y'all hear that? You said my kind. Yeah, people like you don't live in here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's seriously some Why the hell would I come and try to steal that shit? Like, she needs to stop thing in your head. Why would I do that for both of me? That is really stupid. That is really fucking stupid. I just lost $30 to this stupid store. I mean, I mean, he's red for a reason. Like, why the f would I lie so Have a good weekend. Thank you. <laughs> Karen goes wild after getting caught stealing in the store. She keeps screaming at the workers and starts smashing things while the poor workers try to calm her down. That's 
don't know. We do not know her at all. She just said, all right. She touched me in the system. I'm, I'm, I'm recording. She, yeah, she acting. Please don't. This Padres fan may have had one too many drinks, leading to a point where six security guards had to drag her out of the game. Thankfully, no one was injured, but it was quite a scene. This cop in this restaurant can't stand the music this guy is playing, so he decides to show off his power and threatens the guy. But when the guy isn't scared of him, Kevin's ego gets hurt and arrests the poor guy for absolutely no reason. Can we know, uh, talk, spread it yourself? No, what, what's the problem? a scene inside the store. Nobody's causing oh, a scene. Yeah, you are. No, we ain't. Yeah. Put my spirit. No, we ain't. Uh, yeah. No way. When I can hear you all the way over there, there's a problem. All right, that's cool. Oh, that's a that's full of shit. We can spread ourselves with whatever oh, we want. No, what I'm telling you is, you can eat in peace. I'm going to jail. I'm not going, I'm not going to sit and argue with you. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to argue with you. But, I mean, you can come over here and tell us that. Yeah, I can. I can. No, tell you can't. Come over here and tell No, you can't. Yeah, I can. I'm over here in my house. Let's stand up. Public service. Let's stand up. Why? You're going to jail. Stand up. Huh? Yeah, you are. It's the enemy, my no, stand up. Here. Central Mass. I want to grab, record that. I'm going to go. Record it. No, stand up. Stand up or I'm going to yank you up. Stand up. You can. You record that. Record that. That's fine. You record it. Stand up. I didn't do nothing. Put your hands back. Record it. Come on, amigo. Oh, man. Record that. Here's my phone. I don't have that. Okay. Give me a little. Got your ID in here? Yeah. I got it. Oh, let me go. Come on, man. I didn't knock him. He's going to take me to jail. It's just fine. It's fine. It's fine. Go ahead. I'll make y'all marry Waffle House. Hey, Saul. So you got it? You got it? Huh? Come on, boss. Come on, let's go in this place. It's, it's good, man. I Come on, man. We're just having a good time. It's okay, yeah. man. It's fine. Let's do it. 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 Let's do
I know there wasn't no need for uh, there wasn't no need for all that arguing and everything else. Yeah, we know. Come on, man. It's that's look, dude, man. I mean, I'm How much gonna tell you. you had to drink tonight? Not, not enough, man. Come on, man. Come on. I mean, it's it's ridiculous. It is ridiculous. You know. So how much have you had to drink tonight? Nothing, man. You've had something. I can smell it. Smell what? Coffee? No, the liquor. Oh, oh amigo. Come on, amigo. That is not. You need to I am. This is You need to calm down. I am. I'm the hardest on the butt. This delivery driver appears to have caught some sass from one of this business owner's customers and clapped back to the point where the business owner felt compelled to confront her. Come on, man. We got people recording me without yeah, permission. You're in plain view. I sure am, and you are too. All I asked you is to not be rude to my customer. That's all I asked. You started calling me names. I never once called you anything. What did I call you, ma'am? Baby. Oh, oh, I thought you said I called you a cuss word. No, that's not what I said. Okay, baby. Oh. And do what with it? <laughs> and do what with it? What y'all gonna do with it? I don't it? understand what your problem is. I don't understand what y'all problem is. Only thing I wanna do is come do my job. When y'all making that hard on me, I cannot do my job. This is the pickup point. I have this to use this bad. ramp. I have to use this ramp to get to get my mail. And that's the pickup. This is the, you're not going to tell me what's the pickup point for my job. Me, Are you seriously I've, telling me how to do my job? I've worked here for 20 I don't care years. How many, I don't care how many years you worked here for. Do I need to call dudes? Because y'all lie and say she do this, She used to do this and do that. But every time I ask her, she just said she never did it. I have nothing to say to you. And so why you staying right here talking to me then? Exactly. You came out here to do what? You, you came being, out here to do what? Extreme. You came out here to do what? You, were being you came out here to do what? You yeah. came out here to do what? You came out here to do what? You're standing right here talking to me for you, what? You won't even you, let me talk. I don't want to hear you talk. Oh. I've been saying that from the beginning. Here we have this crazy woman climbing on top of the airplane seats as if the floor is lava. How do people like this exist? It boggles my mind every time I see someone like this. Yeah. 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 I just got, got that. Yeah, yeah. You're gonna Good. be online. Good. You're gonna be Good. online. Good. I got you. you what got am you. I again? What am I again? I got you. Somebody find this man, please. Why don't you go? Go back in your house. All I'm doing is working. Okay. Well, you got a lawsuit on you now. Okay. okay. What, is, what is your name and the name of your garden service? I cannot. Listen to me. I am telling you to stop filming me. Okay, then leave me alone. I'm trying to. I'm trying to document this for my safety and yours. Okay. <laughs> Sancho's Garden Service. Okay. 
Would you like my phone number? Hold on. <laughs> Can I have your phone number and your name too? Yeah. Four two zero. Four two zero. Okay, and that's the name of the servant. Yes. And what is your name? Sancho. Okay, and what is your phone number? That was it. Okay, so you're the owner of this business. Yes. And what is your last name? Love. Okay, is that your actual legal name? Si. Okay. Como te amos? Witnessing a grown man throw a temper tantrum because his attempt to rob a dollar store failed. That's just plain embarrassing. I'm gonna take the food out. Beat it. I'll be back. All right. That's pathetic. That's why you didn't walk out with That's why you're proud! This store manager seems to be confiscating items that were already paid for by this guy, and also appears to be very certain that he can sue the guy for recording him and posting it online. Hey, hey, we already paid for that. You gonna steal that? We already paid for that. You can leave. We already paid for that. You can posted anywhere, I will sue you. Oh yeah, you're going viral, man. I'm going viral? You're going viral, man. You are mistreating your colleague, you are mistreating the customers, you, can you are out. being rude. You are being unpolite. You can get out. You're taking merchandise that was already paid. Take your merchandise that was paid. No, you guys can leave. Was no, it's right there. No, no, it wasn't there. You it's right there. You, find it. No. you took it from the car, put it back on the car, and call your supervisor. I'm calling the if you know, if you don't know how to treat people, just go home, man. You don't you don't I'm you don't have to be the, here. I'm calling the police. You call Look the police. Right. That's fine. Let's call the police. But this is not the way that you have to treat people, man. Go, if it goes viral, I'm suing. Oh, yeah. You're going, you're going viral, man. I hope so, because I will own you. I just need to pay my stuff, man. That, that's it. No, that's all what I need. You're not getting your stuff, sir. Why not? Because of what you're doing right now. I, refu I have the right to refuse service to anybody. So you can leave. I'm not going to leave. Then Call the not. police. Call the police if you want. I'll be waiting for you here. Go ahead and leave, you antagonizer. I'm yeah. just trying to antagonize the situation by videotape and leave my store. I have Go everything leave. on film. Leave private property. Oh, on film. Leave private property. You're not allowed. You're going viral, man. Public property. You're going viral. Go out. You're to going public. viral. What's this your name? Is, this is private. I refuse to. Yeah, you don't know how to treat people. If you don't know how to treat go people, go home. home. You don't have to be working leave here. If you don't know store. how to treat people, go home. Ha! Look at you, man. Woo, you're going famous. Look what you did. 